Okay, I've got the Hero 3 camera here, and I would like to use it for FPV. So what I've done is I've bought the component cable that goes into the USB port of, of the camera. And, uh, but I need to get it into my transmitter. And my transmitter just has these two little wires. So we're going to do a test right now before we start clipping stuff apart to see if I can get it all together and see it in my goggles. Now I've got everything hooked up, batteries going. I can see through it. Great, it is working. So basically all we gotta do is solder the ground and the video cable to this video cable. I'm gonna strip off the red and white audio cable off there to lose some weight. There's another hack out there where a guy cut the sheath off of this and bent the cable back so it's lighter and more aerodynamic. But it appears that we're in good working order now. Let's see if I can get get a shot. Looks like we're FPVing. I'll move the camera. Okay. Yeah, aim the camera at me. So Steve Helgeson is uh, being kind enough to demonstrate what we need to do to get this ready for FPV. He's going to strip out the yellow video cable, so that's all we have. We're going to get rid of the uh, red and white audio cables. Within the video cable, there should be both the video signal wire as well as the ground wire. Exposing the wires. If, all, if it all fails, use the lighter stick. There we go. Then we've got a signal and a ground. The sheath, the wires on the outside are the is the ground. And the signal wire itself has got a sheath for keep the noise level down. It's wrapped in this aluminum. There. Then, then you're getting down to the yellow center, which I might be able to get with the lighter. Yeah. So that makes, you got to make sure this, this ground sheath is a little further away from the, where you're going to make the, the hot connection. It's kind of close here. I'm going to peel back some of that foil around it. There. Get all the ground wires all together. We put the heat shrink on before we do any soldering. Always good to remember. Yep. I'm putting the red on the, the ground just because I'm out of black. Doesn't signify. I think I'm going to get it all wrapped inside anyway. We're going to tin the wires a little bit. Equal length stranded strands of wire. Heat shrink. The strands going straight out, insert them into each other to make one bunch could be soldered. So now we just got to add the heat shrink to that and then the big heat shrink over the whole thing. Yeah. Yeah. Pretty much weatherproof the cable is. Let's weigh it. Five grams, not too bad. Well, it looks like we have FPV. Got the AV cable soldered into the wire going into my FPV transmitter. 
being picked up by the FPV receiver and going into my Fat Sharks. Mission accomplished. And that's how you get your GoPro Hero 3 ready for FPV.